Now it's the 200-yard freestyle. The NCAA record owned by Simon Burnett of Arizona set two years ago. And Michael Phelps owns the American record from just a year ago. And in lane five, it'll be the senior from Arizona. He's from the United Kingdom, Simon Burnett. Well, he won in 03 and 05. He's going to be very tough. He looks so good in the prelims. You know, it's hard to tell whether the prelims give you very much to look at, but he just looks so smooth and in control. Now Mark Peter Vanderkay is a three-time champ. Now, he's the champ in the 500 freestyle. We saw that and broke that long-standing American record. So if he keeps it close, Burnett's more of a sprinter. If he keeps it close at the 150, he'll definitely have a shot. A look at the lane assignments. Arizona has lanes five and eight with Burnett and Ritter. And Stanford will have two swimmers at the bottom of your screen. Andy Grant in lane one and Sean Phillips in lane two. This is eight links of the pool, freestyle. Right next to each other. That's much better for Vander Kay. Because Vander Kay need, knows he needs to keep it close. He knows Simon Burnett's going to be out very fast. He's got so much speed, one of the rare athletes in the world that is so good in both the 50, 100, and the 200. He's just so good in all three events. Fresh off a of victory in the 100 freestyle at the Commonwealth Games, flew straight here from Melbourne, Australia. And at the 50, Burnett has the lead at 21.28. We asked Simon Burnett about his participation in the Commonwealth Games in Australia just days ago and how that travel may impact his performance here in Atlanta. Well, I think for last week uh, or so I thought um, the flight might have, you know, uh, hurt me a little. I mean, just traveling for, yeah, for 20 hours there and then obviously coming back here 20 hours back. It, it's, it's been hard on my body and it's been difficult and I'm, I'm definitely feeling it here. You know, I'm just feeling a bit tired and a bit sluggish. Well, the jet lag doesn't seem to be affecting him <laughs> so far here, Rowdy. Not at all. Look at that kick behind him. He was almost a half a second under the record pace, 108.6. He is a second under the fastest swim in history. It is all Simon Burnett. 200 freestyle, Michael Phelps has the fastest in history. 132.08 is the fastest time in history. He's going to do it. Burnett sets the record. 131.20, an amazing swim for the Arizona senior, Simon Burnett. Frank Bush right there in the middle of the screen, the head coach of Arizona. Look out, Auburn. Arizona is sneaking up. Look at the Wildcat fans. They, everybody's in shock. I think everybody's just stunned. Incredible swim by Simon Burnett, a full second under the old record. Wow. Look at this, and he's so, I mean, his kick, the kick in the 200 has changed dramatically from what it was 20, 25 years ago. His kick was a six-beat, strong, churning kick the entire way. This is a 200 freestyle, minute and a half, and everybody is completely out of the picture, and they all had some pretty good time. There's some pretty good swimmers in that. And look at this finish. He puts his head down. There's about five meters left. Boom. Wow. Wow, look at that. He knew it right away, too. He knew it right away. Cynthia Potter has the new 200 free record holder, Simon Burnett. Simon, you are unbelievable. We know you just got back from Australia, and you thought you were going to be tired, but it certainly didn't look like it. Well, I was certainly tired by the end. Um, I wanted to swim my own race. I knew after Van der Kay's stellar performance yesterday that he had a great back end, so I just wanted to put myself out there. Did you have any idea or designs on this record? I didn't. I, did. I came in here, so, you know, this has just been our night, you know, and I wanted to keep the momentum going. I knew if I put myself out there, I wasn't going to be in a good position, so it just all fell into place. Right on. A heck of a swim for those Wildcats. Absolutely. That's what it's all about, Wildcats. Being that Burnett is from the UK, it's not an American record, but it's 131.20. What a swim. Peter Vanderkay of Michigan second, and it's Mike Tree of California third. Thank you.